Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing for you my December favorites. I was planning on doing a New Year's look for you. I swear I was planning to do one. But um, this is what I looked like on New Year's Eve. Yeah, so nothing to worry about. Um, for those of you that don't know, I did get a septoplasty, rhinoplasty last year. And so I just went to get it touched up a little bit. Um, something called a nasal rasping, um, where he just basically went in and sawed into my nose for a little bit. Yeah. So I basically was a trooper and I did spend New Year's Eve out and I did try and look my best. Um, let me know if you want to see the look that I did end up doing for New Year's. It basically consisted of the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Gold Mine and also the Urban Decay Heavy Metal um, this is the glitter, glitter eyeliner. So I basically, um, did my wing and then above it I did the gold eyeliner and then on top of that I did the gold glitter. So let me know if you want to see me recreate that look for you because I definitely could. I just was not looking my best on New Year's Eve, so I wasn't really going to film myself the way I was looking and feeling. Anyway, so let's dive right into my December favorites. I have two makeup products that I am loving for December and two skincare products. So first I'm going to start off with skincare. Um, for those of you that are new to my channel, um, I believe in my, um, December look, holiday look, I mentioned that I was just breaking out a ton and my skin was just not looking good. And I'm one of those people that when I have a ton of breakouts, I just don't want to go out. I'm just like, nobody look at me right now. Um, so that's how I feel when I get breakouts. But I purchased this Peter Thomas Roth therapeutic sulfur mask and it says it's an acne treatment mask. So I went into Ulta actually looking for something else specifically as an acne treatment to help me out with my situation and I stumbled upon this and I'm so happy I did because I ended up buying this and I do not regret it at all. Um, I have had nothing but great experiences with the Peter Thomas Roth line in general. I also have their mud mask that I absolutely love. So when I saw this, I was like, well, I am looking for an acne treatment and I do love Peter Thomas Roth. They are on the pricey side, but I was hating my skin so much at that point that I was like, I will try and pay anything to clear up my skin right now. So I went home and I tried this and this says it's 10% sulfur and it clears acne. And so I got home and I just kind of like put it on all my problem areas. And let me tell you guys, this stuff works. Within like two days of using this, all my problem areas were dried up, cleared out, and I just had some, you know, scarring because it's, I'm going to be honest with you guys that uh, if I have a pimple, I'm going to pop it. I'm sorry. I just can't. I, I have to pop it. So I do have some scarring, and so now I'm just trying to, you know, heal that up. But as far as clearing up my problem areas, this stuff works. So this is a mask and you just put it on all the spots that are problem areas that you want to clear up and it can be drying so make sure you're also balancing it out with a moisturizer too like I did but I absolutely love this and this was such a great impulse buy um, and now I'm going to use it for whenever I feel like I'm having horrible horrible breakouts. 
The next skincare item is actually makeup remover um, wipes or cleansing towelettes, as it says on here. And these were actually a gift um, that I got for Christmas. And I got them Christmas Eve from my aunt who works for Johnson & Johnson. And I used them Christmas Eve, like immediately, to wipe off all my makeup. And instantly, I fell in love with them. I was like, oh my god, these are the best wipes ever. Cleansing towelettes, I mean. So these are the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelettes Night Calming. Ultra soft, nourishing cloths gently dissolve all traces of makeup, even waterproof mascara. And I've used Neutrogena makeup remover wipes before, um, but I've never felt how I feel about these wipes right here. I don't know if it's because of the night calming part of it, but they just feel so great on my skin, like so nourishing and gentle because I have very sensitive skin. I get red very easily, uh, but these just felt so nice. And then on top of that, you know how like when you want to remove your eye makeup and you just keep scrubbing at your eye? This, seriously, it just took like one swoop and my makeup was gone. And just one swoop here and my makeup was gone. So not only are these absolutely amazing at getting off your makeup, but they also just feel so great on the skin. I absolutely love them and I told my aunt immediately. I was like, uh, these wipes you gave me, they're just, I am obsessed with them. I fell in love with them from day one. Totally recommend them. Now for my two makeup items. So my first one is the It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Color Correcting Full Coverage Cream Plus Anti-Aging Hydration Serum Plus SPF 50 Plus Sunscreen, whatever. So I feel like I am a little late to jump on this bandwagon and I was seriously getting tired of people raving about this CC cream. Um, I was seeing it all over Instagram, all over YouTube channels, tons of people love it, and I was just like, I don't know. So I decided to uh, get it. <laughs> so um, I decided to get the, I know there's another one too, is it the, the, the Radiance one? Illumination? I don't know, I know there's another one that's more like illuminating, but I have oily skin, and so I didn't want to look too shiny, cause I get shiny all, already, as it is. So I got the regular one, and I, I have to admit that I love it. I can't stop wearing it. I wear it to work, I wear it every day, I wear it out, you name it, I wanna wear it. It, this also goes hand in hand with when I said I was breaking out a lot and my skin was just awful. I started wearing this and I felt like I wasn't breaking out anymore, so it wasn't causing any more breakouts, which I love. And then it was also covering up the breakouts that I had, so it was great coverage. And I also just felt like it made my skin just feel better overall. So, um... I have nothing but great things to say about this. I got the shade medium. Um, I am a little pale because it's not summer and I'm not tan. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to get another shade darker in the summertime because um, I love this. I can wear this anytime, anywhere, and it just makes me feel great. Long lasting, I'm not like... I mean, I have had to touch it up a little bit because like I said, I do get oily. And even when I set it with powder, um, I feel like it does get a little oily throughout the day. So I do have to touch it up like once throughout the entire day and that's fine. That's cool. 
And my last beauty item is this little tiny thing right here. This is Bare Minerals Pop of Passion. Uh, I, you know what, I got this in, did I use my points? I think I might have used my points at Sephora. Um, I think, I think I used my points to get this and it's like a little sample size. Um, it's Bare Minerals, I don't know if it's like a liquid lipstick. No, it's like a moisturizing lipstick. I, I, I'll find, I'll look it up and I'll put the information down below for you. Um, but I, this, this came in one of my orders and I'm pretty sure I used my points to get it and try it out. And I wasn't even paying attention to when I added it to my cart and used my points. I was just like, whatever, I'll just pick this. And I actually started using it and I love it. It's Plumberry Pop is the shade and it's a lipstick, but it's super moisturizing. I'm wearing it right now. I love the color. It's, su it, I keep saying super moisturizing, but it is. It's super moisturizing. It feels great on the lips. It's like I'm not wearing lipstick, but I am. Like, it just feels like there's nothing on my lips, and yet it also feels like my lips are hydrated at the same time. It just feels awesome. So I've been wearing, I've been keeping this in my purse and just wearing it every day just to give me that like pop of color and liven things up a little bit um, because it feels like I'm wearing nothing. Yet at the same time, it's giving me a really cute and nice look when I go out. And that was it for my December favorites. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know if you have any questions about any of the products that I mentioned and make sure to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe. Thanks guys.